As you know, or you should know, or you will know soon, I'm a self-proclaimed geek. Um, I'm a self-proclaimed Trekkie. I'm not as into Star Trek as some people, but I really am into it. But, and if, if you've watched any of my videos, you also know that uh, being an active dad is a really important thing to me. Really a big deal. This morning I was walking my daughter to school. Um, I love spending time alone with her. I haven't got a chance to walk her to school in probably a week and a half. And she was excited about walking with me. And, because that's a one-on-one -on -one time with us. No, okay, I just told you that to tell you what I'm about to tell you about Star Trek. She, um, she said, Dad, you know Derek didn't know there was a difference between Star Wars and Star Trek? And she was horrified. I mean, this, this is a 10-year-old girl who was, she was like, I can't believe he doesn't know this. Because she asked him about Yoda and Darth Vader, and asked him the simple question, is Yoda and Darth Vader on Star Trek? He said, I don't know, I guess. And she was like, I don't know all the characters of Star Trek, but I know they're not on it. And I think that's really important, that people know some of the basics, you know? Even if you're not a Trekkie, or you're not a Star Warsy, I don't know if they're even called, because I'm not into that franchise, you need to know that they're different. Um, because they are. And it, it just it makes me so proud as a dad that my daughter knows there's a difference. She went into talking about Star Wars characters. She said, I don't know a lot about them, but um, what about some S Star Trek guys? I I've seen the movie. Didn't you see the movie? And I was like, yeah. She's like, isn't... McCoy, a doctor in Star Trek, and Spock, she does this thing. She did it with her other hand, with her left hand. And then with her right hand, she did this. She goes, I can't do it with my right hand. But that's a Spock thing. Um, what, what, what's a Vulcan? So she, she's probing. This is important. We've got to pass this on to our kids. We've got to pass the love of Star Trek and Star Wars on to our kids. I'm not really big into Star Wars, but I encourage my girls to at least watch the movies. Come on. Um, if you don't like them, that's fine. I don't like a lot about Star Wars either, but I, I, I like them. There is a difference. Some people think this is going away from parenting altogether. But some people think... Um, well, if you like Star Trek, you must like Star Wars, because they equate the two. No, it's not necessarily the case, because they are very different. Star Wars and S Star Trek are totally different franchises. They're lumped together because they both have robots and spaceships. Okay, but there's a one science fiction, one's fantasy. At least that's how I see it in my mind. Star Wars has a spiritual aspect. It has the force. It has a mystical... You're able to do something. It's in the galaxy far, far away. It's not on Earth at all. There's no... It's... That's a fantasy world. That's fantasy. Um, Star Trek has ranks. You know, you're... You, they, they're they based on human naval ranks. You know, and they, the star... The Star Trek um, Starfleet is it has ranks. It's it's centered on Earth. Um, yeah, it's hundreds of years in the future, but it's Earth. It's grounded on in science. In fact, that makes it science fiction. It doesn't make it better. It really doesn't. Um, I like Star Trek a lot, but that doesn't mean it's better. I can just I can just probably argue with the better of them and the, that w what I like, but it's not it's just opinion. It's just opinion. Star Wars since it started off as a movie franchise um had bigger budget in general and than than Star Trek. Uh, better better 
special effects. Um, and as a motion picture, it started out with more numbers in their fan base than Star Trek. Yeah, Star Trek has, I think, over the over time, has more hours hours logged on film because there have been a lot of movies, a lot of TV shows. More hours logged on film, but it's taken a while to reach as many people as Star Wars reached by 1982. I mean, a movie had been out for a couple of years, and some people knew about Star Wars, and there there were bigger numbers. That's the big reason, or a couple of reasons, I guess, of why Star Wars is more popular. But they're not equal. That's what I'm outraged about: is people who think that the two are equal. You like one, you gotta like the other. They tell us it's not.